The van was full when looting McCoy's warehouses, and I had to be very selective about the items I was going to take back with us. The only carry capacity we had was what we could take in our bags. On the hunt for axes, we only ended up finding one, maybe two, it was a letdown. On the way home, we drove by the other Muldraw warehouses and Cortman Medical, where zombie populations appeared to be quite low. These are going to be our next points of interest to loot. Good evening, welcome to Eric Gaming. This is David and we are playing Project Zomboid. David has survived 13 days, 14 hours, 469 zombies killed, getting down to 85 kilograms. I have started late just because we're coming up on day three of this laceration. This is still here. It's still there. Let's go ahead and disinfect. Let's bandage. I don't know if I have any food here. That's one thing that I have been lacking in. Um, the reason I'm starting tonight is we may show signs of zombification. Uh, this is going to be day three, so what I'm going to do is we are going to just hang out, read, see if anything accumulates. Here's a drink. This might help a little bit. Um, and see if we get aggravated. The last cigarette was uh, right before I ended the last episode, so hopefully, hopefully we're okay. And I don't know why I continue to sleep out here. We can sleep on the couch. Which is what we're going to do. Alarm is on. Set for 9 o'clock, I think. These are looking okay. This is going to be the third day. I'm a slow healer. So it's going to take me a while to heal. Let's just take a look. Still there. Just do another disinfect. I'm going to go through all my disinfecting alcohol wipes, but that's okay. Slight damage, still nothing. I haven't even smoked a cigarette. Things are looking promising. Um, we went to sleep with the lights on. They are now off. And upon further inspection, we are out of electricity. Okay, water's gone out. Electricity's gone out. I do have a Jenny. So it's not like we are without. Let's um, get rid of some stuff. I did get some pickaxes. In fact, let's go ahead and equip that on my back. We are going to get rid... Oh, yeah, my junk drawer's out here now. I haven't really put much organization or thought process into any of this. I've just thrown things in random uh, boxes and crates and cupboards. Because... Oh, there's some food. Um, plan on moving here soon. Four lighters I don't need. Got six wood glue. That's a good amount. Is that a fresh axe? That is a fresh axe. That's a fresh pick pickaxe. I don't know if all this will fit. It will not all fit. Let's move over to this one. It'll all fit in here. Um, and eventually we're going to move. Uh, I don't think I'm going to find a vehicle. I haven't come across any trailers. So when we do make this move, it might be uh, without a lot of I Oh, a lot of items I've already collected. Uh, no multi-hit. So this is one at a time kind of fight. Let's get this pickaxe out and see what's behind me. We're clear. One at a time. I have my... That was pretty good. Two gone. Come on, guys. There's another one. Another one. You should go down. You're dead. Okay, pickaxe may be my weapon of choice that I'm going with. I know it's a little cliche, but uh, this is this is vanilla, and um, there's no mods. Obviously, that's why I say it's vanilla. And there's no multi-hit, which really slows down the combat. It really is hitting one zombie at a time, which is a nuisance. Uh, the axe is double, I mean, the pickaxe is double handed, so if I get to a bag, we're gonna have to switch to a nightstick. Did I empty? I think I am going to empty out some of this stuff. Let's go ahead and uh, today's, we're, we're taking it easy today. We're seeing if things accumulate, if we get worse. Uh, let's grab the videos and the books. Oh, yeah, I forgot we got. I am going to need more storage 
and we can get the Dr. Oids out of here. That might be one of the things we're going to leave behind. I can read, like these magazines I can read and get those finished. I only have these two duffel bags. These are the largest bags I have. I haven't found any uh, hiking bags. I haven't found any school bags. I haven't found any military bags. Let's dump this stuff out. Um, I'm trying to think of any containers I have. I just have this bookshelf here. Go ahead and I guess put some... Oh wait, I've already designated this bookshelf as books. Uh, and we can watch some uh, videos today? I don't think we're zombified. But this is the third day. This is zombification should uh, show symptoms within the uh, first two to three days after after initial contact. Is that the right word? We're just moving this off the seat. We're going to get it inside for right now. We, we do not need electricity. Electricity is not a necessity, but it's nice to have the Jenny. And is the bag still here? Let's go ahead and equip. Another thing we can do is that might not be a bad idea. We can hit up Courtman. We can go to that other storage place. How many, how many, uh, Shotgun boxes do I have? Oh yeah, I have a machete now too. I have four boxes of shotgun shells. What's that? That's 80 of uh, 80, 90. That's, that's math. I stopped after I started calculating. Uh, this stuff, don't really have a place for it. Place all. Oh, it's placing them one at a time? Fair enough. Gotta put it all in my main inventory before I can set it down. It's hurting me. That was a mistake. What are you doing? It's really taking forever to do this. You're really concentrating at this, aren't you, sir? Man, that took forever. Uh, let's get some water. Pour into water bottle. And pour into an empty bottle. And now let's go ahead and place this item back on the stove. Let's go. Um, did we hit up... I got my trusty axe. Let's have a snack. And let's, yeah, let's go hit up Cortman. No, I want to take it easy. What is that noise? Is it just the rain I'm hearing? It must be. Okay. I need food, though. That is one thing I'm lacking. Ah, oh, these decisions. Well, first off, let's get a woodcraft. Let's get some woodcrafting at books in here. Let's get some magazines I haven't read. That's it? I thought there were more. Oh, well. Um, and carpentry... Two. Okay, let's go in. We are... Ah, shit. I just realized electricity's out. Take generator. Um, want to put a Jenny outside is what you want to do. You can't keep it indoors. Uh, I'm going to keep it a little ways away from the place so they don't... start banging on, on my house. Connect generator... Um, they're gonna come and they're, the sound of the generator is gonna attract zombies. I don't know how big the radius is gonna be, the sound radius, but it'll be there and it will pull in some. And of course, we need fuel to operate the generator.
add fuel, uh, let's add, yeah, I guess just the whole thing, and, oh yeah, turn on. Okay, now we can watch the movies, the educational programs. This is my first cigarette today. I really don't think we are zombified. Uh, this, turn on, and let's take this, where are the movies, here they are, Woodcraft episode 2, and play, and then we will go ahead and read a magazine, oh, I should be reading the books first, well, oh well. I've already started it. I don't want to stop it. I want to get all... It'll count as if I've watched it. Yeah, I know some of you more experienced zombie players are probably freaking out right now. Sorry. Read this. Sit down. Read. This is going to take forever. It's going to go well into the afternoon. Didn't I smoke? I thought I smoked. Did I interrupt the process? Or is that a second one? Uh-oh. I wasn't paying attention. Let's hope that was me just interrupting a cigarette earlier and not a second bout of anxiety. Gonna need to eat soon. Drowsy, that's fine. Drowsy's okay. You know what else? Uh, I left the generator running. Hmm. Yeah, I want to finish this book. Didn't bring in any zombies. I really think we're going to be okay. I really do. Getting really hungry. Read that now. Do I have magazines in here that I haven't read? Guns. And I'm so disorganized this playthrough. I feel fine with this one. Let's go ahead and smoke and go to sleep. Uh, there's the chair. Sleep. Yeah, I think we're going to be all right. I do think that. Eat all. And we are going to go do some things today. Um, I'll watch these after I finish reading the book. And do I need the gas can? Not particularly. Boggy. I'm going to put the gas canister back in here. Along with this axe. Are you putting it in there? I don't know what it's doing. And, oops, I didn't mean to bring this. Uh, this can technically just get tossed, but, oh, oh well. What am I throwing in there? The gas canister. And we are just get in. Did I kill the battery? Did I leave the lights on? I turned them off. Okay, um, we are skipping the Midtown Warehouse, and we are going to go straight for Courtman and the South Warehouse. Those were the two clearest ones we were at the other day, and that's what we're going to do today. And we're going to stop by a grocery store or some kind of quick food market and get some food. And we might raid some houses because there'll be food in houses and we need some beta blockers. Beta blockers are often found in bathrooms of houses and at Cortman. And we need more axes, which is why we're going to the warehouse. 
turn here. Oh, this isn't, well, we're, I've, I've committed. This isn't the way I, there's another way. A faster way. A less zombie filled way. Direct way. Still no trailers, huh? I still have che not checked the engine. Last time we checked is when we first got the vehicle. And it was at 80 something. 80, 83, or 89. It was in the 80s. Nope, they broke through the gate. Which is fine. That gate didn't used to be there. I thought that was an axe. I think most of the axes I'm going to find are going to end up being off of zombies themselves, not so much found in crates and warehouses. But we shall see. This is looking good. Portman's back there. We forgot to stop and take a look. Why are you guys right in the way? Thank you. This is where we want to be. And that's a good start. All this pickaxe is going to be really nice. Okay. There's windows. We can get into this place. This place, we might have to break a window if the door's locked. Hell, we could even make this a, a, a southern outpost. Check in the rear. Hey, guys, get off the windows. Get off the windows. Come here. You're going to break the windows. You're going to break the windows. And these guys are going to break the windows, too. Oh, shit. I saw him at the vehicle. Don't you worry, I saw them. Sure's a slow swing though. I think we're gonna get further with this than we are with the metal pipes. slow I have to I'm, I'm analyzing the speed and the zombies approach uh, this is not a weapon I'm I actually use very often I do not use this I don't use axes a lot in this game I'm really glad I haven't started running out of breath okay. they may have broken the window back here uh, more were coming in as I was approaching. I hear some inside. So there's definitely some inside. And some could have... There goes the window. You asshole. That was a really bad swing. Thank you. Let's check the door. Whoops. Hey, buddies. The police station's just across these trees. There's just no easy path, easy road to get here. Oh, I thought I heard somebody in here. One time I got in here, I walked up the stairs, and there was a zombie sitting right at the top of the stairwell. And, of course, it, it probably got me and killed me. Not today. 
Nothing good. Don't need the water. Okay, let's find axes. Let's find things of use. I said things of use. Yeah, that's useful. Bucket can be useful. Whoops. I have a trowel. I don't need another trowel. Trowels can be used as stabbing weapons. Um, yeah. Metal bars for windows. Oh, I thought I saw an axe. I did see it. There, There is an axe, but this is what my eyeball was looking at. Well, at least we have enough axes for wood, because that, that is really my primary weapon. Uh, primary thing I use axes for is for chopping down trees. But because I'm not coming across a lot of great weapons, and this is rather tough, I have a sledgehammer. Uh, with the one by one, I might end up... Is that the same sledgehammer? End up using a lot more axes. Padlock, I do not need no more metal bars. There's nothing here. This other place is not going to have an axe, but it might have some, like, wood glue. This is a hardware store. I guess, now that I say that, we could try and hit up uh, West Point on the way to Louisville. Still want to head west and get to the Army Surplus Store. No one here. Uh, there's a back entrance, but... That happened. Oh, jeez. Nothing in the refrigerator. Nothing in the microwave. No food whatsoever. Symbol... Okay, axe, axe, another sledgehammer. Man, I wish I needed 20 sledgehammers. Highly disappointed. I don't think uh, axes spawn in these. I take it back. Uh, that I'm not used to. I'll take it. It's a very welcome find. And yes, we will have to leave some loot behind. Did I drop this? What's going on? What happened? Okay. Put this on my back. Is everything here that's supposed to be here? Where's my screwdriver? There's my screwdriver. I feel like something weird just happened. Or I accidentally did something and didn't catch onto what was happening. Put secondary. These can go into there I want this below my back weapon these get listed in uh, the order in which you pick them up okay uh, it's not get the same issue I had the other episode where I had to I guess I have my car where I had to run all the way home with no stamina lots more opportunity for axes huh Red axes. Want some fire axes. Yeah. I saw it. More axes. Exactly what we came here for. Another propane torch. I saw some wood. Yeah. Wood glue coming around the corner here. Another propane torch. And I think we are going to call this complete. 
nothing else I'm going to want here. Any zombies by the vehicle? No. I'm going to unload this stuff. Next stop is Courtman. After a break, we're going to go back in there and sit down. Will all of this fit? Oh, it's getting... Smaller and smaller, the trunk space. I'm doing damage. At least it fit all of this. Okay, let's sit down. What's making me so heavy? I might need to... Might need to put stuff on the seat, which is what I don't want to do, but... I'm gonna have to. And next to Cortman is a grocery store. Do I need to take these? Let's go ahead and take these. Oh, that's all that was left. We'll get more in Cor at Cortman. Oh, never mind. That wasn't my main inventory. Take pills just to keep us awake. We are definitely not zombified. We would have started feeling it by now. Had to have. It was like three days ago. Three in-game days ago. Three real-life days ago. Um, this isn't good enough rest. Why am I so overweight? Is it because I'm hungry? It must just be because I am hungry. Anybody see me jump in? No. There's a small little group there, though. Sit on ground and let's rest. Where'd the bar go? Oh, I guess I don't need to rest anymore. I guess not. I got my resting all up. Do, do vitamins work against resting? Is that a thing? Because I really feel like um, I should have rested a lot longer. What's the best way to get there? Really, this way. I just disrupted everyone. It's going to be lots of generators in this place. There's a car in there. This place is nothing. Nothing special. Church right here. Light tap. Do not put, inflict any extra damage on the car that's needed. That isn't needed. fairly clear down here because this is this is where we're going whoa oh almost almost hit that post right there just have to smoke really quick this out. Okay. And then we'll get some food. We can get houses. I see it behind me. There's someone behind me. See behind me. Okay, I think this route is going to be clear for engagement, and then we're going to try and circle around, maybe head back. As soon as we take out this one in the brown jacket, there we go. I 
I didn't see that they had stopped. Since they have stopped, let's take these three out and then we'll bring on that fourth one that's coming through. And take on the crowd. three right here. Or five. That may have been a mistake getting this close. I haven't uh, gone exhausted yet. That's gonna happen. At least there's only five here. Nope. Turn the music up. closer than that. That was a bad push. There it is. Are we done? There's one left. Uh, let's not risk it. Because you think you see one and then four more show up. Sit on ground. Seventeen... Hundred. That sucks. That sucks. After we just went through all that effort, at least it's just a scratch. That was, that was my fault. Can't blame anyone but me. Fortunately, a scratch has a very low percentage of zombification, but it still happens, and I have been zombified from a scratch. It was embarrassing. Much like this will be if I die from a scratch. I'm sitting down and resting in a place that I knew was quite dangerous. Made it back to the vehicle. These guys are guarding Cortman. Just gotta see what's behind the fence. Okay, they we got four. Yeah, he's not paying attention to us. He's just walking around. was supposed to stop when zombies got close. Didn't, didn't that happen? Maybe it did. And I just uh, wasn't paying attention enough to it. Because I know it got up slow as hell. That's not the zombie I meant to hit.
Two more, then we are at Cortman. Maybe we should go get some food first. First aid or food? I say first aid. We're here. There could be some food inside, too. Anyone here looking okay so far? We got friends outside. Friends that saw me. Okay, we got problems. No first aid just quite yet. Come on, guys. Ah, uh, shoot. Um, I want that. We're gonna have to go nightstick. Take out the crowd. Six. Let's see how well we do with the nightstick now. Not as good. Definitely feels like a blunt weapon. Okay, I think we got the majority of them out back. There's still a few left to go. Oh, shit. And a guy with a blue baseball cap. Might be able to take him out before the others arrive. Maybe. Maybe. Really? There he goes. Exhaustion just kicked in. I knew that was coming. There's still more. I'm going to end this episode when they are done. Shut the door. Uh, sit on ground and rest. Is that it? Oh, maybe we are done. The music didn't know we were done either. Okay, let's get some health and then we'll go upstairs and we'll get some food. Finally, those are the beta blockers I've been looking for. Take those pain pills. Antidepressants I don't need. These I need. This, this, that. Sure, sure, sure. I don't have scissors, so maybe I should take some scissors. And let's grab this other duffel bag out and put secondary, since we are now 
using the nightstick, we can do one-handed weapons. Or we, we have to do one-handed weapons. This. Um, I don't know what a scalpel would even be used for. don't need any of that, uh, except for that bottle of disinfectant. Yeah, you know what? And then we could also... Oh, I, I need some water. Let's take these bandages, and then we can make some sterilized bandages. Uh, disinfect bandages. Uh, I guess we could do all five. Let's just go ahead and do all five, and then we have them. Sterilized bandage. Let's go get some water and go upstairs. And call it an episode. We're obviously staying the night here tonight. And that's all the water we have. There's a bathroom here. Fill all. And that's it. Okay, let's go sleep at the Cortman's. Comfy bed. Okay, food. Any food? Stale. Uh, yes, let's open up this. Let's open up this, get some protein. And let's eat. Let's eat. And hopefully we will not get infected from our new injury. Um, alcohol wipes. Sterilized bandage. Painkillers. Clean. Disinfect. Alright, let's get some sleep. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good day. We make be zombified again. Oh. Have a good day. Bye.